Hey guys, it's Anita T from FactFirstFitness.com. Today I'm going to be talking to you guys about chronic inflammation and a little hack that you guys can use to actually get rid of chronic inflammation in your body. Chronic inflammation is a really dangerous and scary thing because scientific research is actually discovering this type of inflammation to be at the root of disease. And to make matters worse, it's actually way more common than you might think. By reducing any chronic inflammation in your body, you actually are increasing your body's chance of being healthier longer. So before I get to telling you guys a little hack to get rid of chronic inflammation, I just need to explain to you a little bit about the mechanism behind how chronic inflammation works. Chronic inflammation is really different to regular inflammation that happens in your body or acute inflammation. Basically the way the inflammatory system works is that inflammatory cells lay dormant in an area of the body known as the barrier. When an immune activation occurs, these immune cells leave the barracks and travel down the boulevard or the bloodstream to the site of the wound. So this can be anything like if you've had an infection or a burn or if your foot has been chopped off even then all these immune cells are going to rush to that area of your body and they're going to do their job as an immune system and then they're going to disappear once the job is done. That's how acute inflammation works. Now, with chronic inflammation, it's a little bit different. See, with chronic inflammation, there's no actual battlefield. There's no wound, there's no infection, nobody's limbs have been chopped off. So what happens? Well, your immune cells still leave the barracks and travel down the bloodstream, but they're looking around, doing this surveillance, kind of going, where is this wound? Where should we be going? And since there's no actual physical wound that's occurred, they have nowhere to go and do their job. So essentially, these immune cells continue to circulate the bloodstream, and that's what chronic inflammation is. This type of chronic inflammation actually occurs commonly from our daily activities, such as poor food choices where we're putting things in our bodies that our body isn't totally familiar with and isn't totally natural, so our immune system kind of wakes up and goes, hey, what is that? I'd better go check it out or sitting down too much and having your digestive system compressed all day and your immune system going, hmm, something's wrong, I'd better go check that out. These are all the types of activities that contribute to chronic inflammation. And when they accumulate, like I mentioned earlier, they can be really, really dangerous and a scary thing for your body. So I'm gonna tell you guys about a way that you can actually reduce chronic inflammation in your body and make your bodies healthier and happier. And that way is getting back to nature. Plants are amazing. Not only do they provide us with the food we eat, the air we breathe, but they also help to regulate our immune system. The way that they do this is plants actually release compounds that interact with our skin. When they interact with our skin, it's actually enough to elicit a very, very mild immune reaction. This immune reaction is basically undetectable to our conscious minds, but our body knows exactly what's going on. This actually provides a battlefield for your immune system to go to, to be able to do its job and then disappear. So essentially, by being around plants, you're pulling the chronic inflammation out of your body, which is absolutely amazing. So how can we practice this? It's really simple. Just get outside. Exercising in a gym is totally different than exercising outdoors. Your body is gonna have a totally different biological response to it. Even just being in nature in general, your body is going to get immune benefits and biological benefits from this. So get outside, rub up against plants and trees if you can. Seriously, go hug a tree. I know that sounds a little bit crazy and you guys probably think that I'm just some hippie with these hilarious theories about hugging trees. I'm not. I'm a published scientist with a master's education and I'm telling you guys, get outside and hug some trees. I promise you, I do it too. In fact, one great way that I commonly practice this is I go for runs outside and I actually try and touch the trees while I do it. I jump up, I make a game of it, so I'm getting more exercise in the vertical plane, but I'm also getting those immune benefits from it. So it's the same workout, it's the same amount of time, but you're actually benefiting way, way, way more from it. So guys, get outside today. Hug some trees, go for a walk in nature, even just go sit and meditate and just be around plants if you can. And it'll really do your immune system good. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. And if you guys want a scientist on your side to give you guys all these weird facts about hugging trees, then subscribe to my channel below and give this video a thumbs up. See you guys next time. Are you hugging them? Look guys, I do it too, I swear. These are some immune benefits right here. I'm, I'm kidding, this is fake, but I, I do do it, I swear.